Hey gang, Daryl Davis here. So it's just a few days that we're going to have the, the NFL playoffs or whatever it's called. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm not into sports, but I am going to uh, an NFL party, yay, because they have alcohol there. Anyway, and food, that's good things. Uh, I, I don't know if I'm going to watch the game, but I'm definitely going to party. So I want to talk to you, though, being that it's the football time and the NFL thing about a football analogy. You know, uh, the amazing thing about NFL players, they, you know, obviously they get paid a lot of money. And the reason why they get paid a lot is because they're so, so good. They've mastered the art of playing the game of football. And the question is, how do they get to that? How do they get to a level of mastery? Well, because they're committed to constantly improving their skill and their ability in, in whatever position they're playing. Now, I just want to talk about the receiver. You know, to the receiver, whenever I see a receiver thrown and the ball's thrown at him and, and some of the moves and some of the ways they move their body is just incredible. Now, my question is, do you think that they're thinking about how to move their body, how to move their hips, how to raise their hands? Of course not, right? What they are doing is they are instinctively just dancing with the ball. They are, when the ball is coming at them, they just... They don't think, they just are, because they've mastered their position so well. And I start to think that life is like that. That life throws footballs at us in our relationships, in our business, um, in our personal lives. Some of those footballs are successes and some of those are challenging. Some are harder to grasp than others. And so this week, as we get into the NFL and next week and everything else, let's look at how are we catching the, our life, our, our ball of life, if you will, our football of life in all of those areas that are important, our family, our relationships. And let's be committed to really mastering how we catch that ball. Let's really master our relationships. Let's really look at how can we deal with problems and challenges in an artful, professional way. So... Uh, I'm going to go now, and I, I hope you have a great weekend. Enjoy the game, and have a wonderful day. My son just walked into the... No. <laughs> Get out of here. Oh. All right, bye. Have a great week. Bye.